Hey guys, welcome to Grace Automation and Engineering Services. In this video, we are going to discuss the control system for uh, three motors and for their lubrication. Here we have uh, three motors, motor 1, 2 and 3. These all have separate outputs for the lubrication. So, the requirement is on pressing the start button motor 1 should turn on and it should remain on and then after the 5 second of that motor 2 should turn on and similarly after uh, the 5 second of motor 2 the motor 3 should also turn on and when uh, these three motors keep on for 30 seconds all the motors should stop and these should uh, wait for the start button to start again meanwhile if the stop button is pushed at uh, uh, any time the all motors should stop immediately so uh, the second task is the lubrication of the motors uh, so when each of the motor has completed five cycles mean it has turned on and off for five times then we need to lubricate that so uh, we shall uh, monitor that how many times the motor has turned on and off and if uh, it's turned on and off for uh, five times we shall turn on the relevant output to lubricate that motor so for example for the motor one we have the output motor one crease and similarly for the motor 2 and motor 3 so the lubrication time will be 3 seconds so these output will be on for 3 seconds now let's move towards the about the software where we have the logic to control the system let's start the simulator load the program into simulator and run the simulator now let's turn on the monitoring mode here we can see that initially all the outputs are off motor 1 2 3 all are off and uh, the outputs for lubrication are also of motor 1 grease, motor 1 2, motor 2 grease, motor 3 grease are also off. So let's uh, press the start button, control F2. So here motor 1 has uh, started but motor 2 and motor 3 are off and after the 5 seconds motor 2 has also turned on and then after the 5 seconds motor 3 has also turned on so now all of these motors will be on for 30 seconds and after that they will turn off so let's observe that so here we can see that after the 30 seconds all the motors has turned off so now we need to press the start button again so here we can see that again the motor 1 has turned on and after 5 seconds motor 2 turned on and then after the 5 seconds motor 3 turned on so now let's uh, uh, press the stop button here we can see that by pressing the stop button all the motors stop immediately so to start those again we need to press the start button again so here we can see that motors has started again here we are counting that how many times the motors has turned on and off here we can see that uh, motor 1 has uh, turned on for uh, 3 times and similarly motor 2 and 3 are also turned on for 3 times the lubrication output will be turned on for uh, 3 seconds to lubricate the motors so let's turn on these the, turn on the motors again so now these are 
turned on for four times so now finally I turn on the motors for fifth time so here we can see that lubrication turned on for three seconds and then it turned off so the logic is working fine as per requirement thanks for watching see you next time